bear with me. I'm sorry about the loud noise. It is, if you can see, it is very white outside. We are fully off grid, if you knew that or not. Um, we had a day of clouds and then we got ice last night and it's been snowing all day and there's no way to get that ice off the solar panel. So Tim has to have the generator going to charge the batteries. Anyway, I'm not able to do the regular setup for this because the generator is literally on the other side of the wall. So anyway, this is for the Hanger Swirl Soap Challenge Club. I've done a handful of them so far and this is hopefully the last set I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do four different loaves of Hanger Swirls and hopefully get some cool designs out of here. This one I'm going to be doing three. Let me show you my inspiration piece. I've actually had this. This is out of catalog. This is actually a shower curtain. I want to do three of the secret feather and hopefully do three different flowers. I'm going to do um, an orange and yellow, a, a purple, and then a pink of different colors. So we'll see how it goes. Um, so I've got a lot of colors in here. Oh my gosh, so there's two greens, two purples, um, orange and yellow, and then two colors of pink. I'll have to divide out. This one I'm going to try to do a butterfly swirl using a similar technique that I have tried already but using some colors that will be hopefully be like a monarch. So I've got my black, I have some Aussie red clay, I have some white, and then an orange over here. I'm gonna do some fun swirls. I'm not quite sure how that one's gonna turn out, but my plan is to do a solid layer in the middle and then do swirls on the outsides. And then this one, I don't have any colors in it because it's going to be a mix of some of the ones I have set out already. But this one, I'm just gonna do some hanger swirls, just some some freehand ones and see how that one turns out. So for the fragrance, because I want it to go along with the release I have coming up in a couple of months, I'm going to use a Grapefruit Glow. This is supposed to be non-accelerating, no issues with this, but it does discolor to yellow, which will be fine with all of these. And then I'm going to use some of this one, which is Grapefruit Lily. I love what this one smells like. I have not used it in soap yet, and it's supposed to cause acceleration but I've used it in bath bombs and salts and things like that and melt and pour and it smells really, really good. So this one I'm planning on doing in the middle layer here. So I'm planning on pouring the outside one, swirling them, then adding it to the middle, use the grapefruit glow in these two and then mix whatever's left into this last one. So fingers crossed and ready for the first one. So again, I'm gonna do four of them. This will be the beginning of each of the four videos and then the actual soap making the cut and then the final look will be at the end. So four parts to this.